Hello, Fear the Meerkat here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play uh, Crash Bandicoot and Sane Trilogy. I like how the different uh, warp rooms look different to each other. See, this one looks slightly different, for example, and so do all the others. So yeah, this level isn't exactly easy, and I don't think I'm going to get through it without dying once and getting a game over, but I'm going to start with this one, because doing it is hard, and cold hard crash is certainly hard. Behaving is digging it, but worse. So, let's go with this. I will not be uh, getting the relics here. Because I'm not that stupid. I am not going to get through any of these without losing at least one life. At least I got a life. Sure, that bit was hard. This bit is worse. This bit is so much worse. Don't forget, you can press B to uh, move yourself upwards, which is something you're going to need. Alright, it might not be yet. I think there might be a place where they move more quickly and uh, they just died there, obviously. Where they move more quickly and you need to be able to use the B button to survive. And this bit's quite tricky too. Those things turn to look at you. I mean, seriously, they do. They they turn to look at you. Oh, right, this is a hard bit. Because you have to be quick. See what I mean? Oh, I thought I could get close in that. Obviously I couldn't. That doesn't mean that I can't, that I won't die now, and uh, then all of that would be pointless because I might end up having to restart. See, even this, which is probably the easiest one left in this warp room. is still pretty darn difficult. Hmm. 
Hmm. There's something there. Let's see, it might be a hidden warp room. It might be a death route. If it's a hidden warp room and not a death route, that means I'm going to have to go through all of this again to get the boxes. I think, though, that it's probably a death route. Yeah. Probably aren't boxes in here. I'm getting lives. I suggest extreme caution. Oh, that happens. Oh, extra lives. Always good. I'm really not looking forward to having to do this level again. I hope that that will not be necessary. And that is a secret warp room, not a way to get more boxes, which means I'm going to have to go through that again. <sighs> well, I suppose I got a secret warp room. And we've uh, we've opened up this, I guess. Not super easy to get the boxes in totally fly, but it's doable. Got a few lies, let's give it a go. So if you wait too long, the fly will just be gone and uh, you won't be able to see anything.
Well, first your instinct is to go forwards quickly, and these are actually some quite tough jumps. So you you don't really sort of pay attention to what you're doing with the jumping. Those of yes, those other two were nitro crates. Ah, now we see the problem. I left the other far fly back there. Rather than actually getting it. Aha. Uh -huh. That's probably the way you're supposed to do it. At least I got that. It's not that bad. Now I suppose I'm going to have to go back and get all of the boxes in uh, hanging out. Before I do that, I think I'm going to start the level off by having some uh, masks and a few more lives. Can. <laughs> and <laughs> I really want to be vindictive, but because somebody said it. Grass Bandicoot 4, I've now played it, and it's a, not a good game. Don't buy it. Promise I won't mention it again. 